Good day, and welcome to Learning Information Systems and Technology, a course for curious people. The purpose of this course is to provide IST training to teachers that promotes high quality instruction without the need for expensive tools. There are three guiding principles that we used to design these course modules. First, uh, we wanted to design course modules with free tools. Ideally, you should not have to spend any money to complete the activities that we've outlined here. Two, we wanna focus on hands-on activities. Ultimately, the best way to learn is to try to do something yourself. And three, we provide free resources. So there's no expensive textbook, uh, there's no shipping, there's nothing, everything is available on the internet and will be free. Now some time for introductions. Uh, my name is Thomas Lombardi and I am the chair of the Information Systems and Technology Department at the University of the Virgin Islands. I'm gonna go ahead and start my camera just so you get a sense of who I am. Uh, every once in a while in these, uh, introdu in these uh, presentations, I might uh, just sort of pop in to make a point or to uh, step from behind the curtain of the presentation just to share something with you. Uh, but I'll be the one guiding you through this course. And if you have any questions, you can reach out to me at the contact information on the website related to this video. For the most part, when I give a presentation, it'll just be about the content. But every once in a while, I might step out and say hello. So, hi, I'm Tom, and I'll be helping you learn uh, these technologies uh, throughout this course. And now a brief course outline. Uh, basically, we wanna talk about four different kinds of things. Uh, one, we wanna talk about the World Wide Web and we'll just refer to that as WWW for most of this course. Uh, we want you to understand things like how an HTML page is made, what other technologies support web pages and get you building those things and feeling comfortable for how to do that. Uh, we want you to understand the internet and networking concepts that make the internet work. We want you to understand general things about computing, which of course uh, is important for making the World Wide Web and the internet work. And then finally, we'll talk about some advanced concepts uh, that are basically driven uh, by interests of students and um, interests of uh, people out in the community. Next time, we'll talk in a little bit more, we'll talk a little bit more in depth about uh, the World Wide Web. We'll give an overview and you'll get a better sense of all of the different things we'll be talking about uh, in the next uh, few modules. Have a great day.